2020 was different in many ways, but that didn't stop Thatcham Research, working in partnership with Euro NCAP, from introducing the biggest changes to car safety testing in more than 20 years. I'm here with Matthew Avery, Director of Research at Thatcham, to find out just how much tougher the tests have become. He's also going to let us know which one of these cars is the Watt Car 2021 Safety Award winner. So Matthew, what's changed with the testing? Well, in 2020, we introduced our mobile progressive deformable barrier crash, which has replaced our main frontal crash, which we've had in place for 23 years. And it's a compatibility test, so it's designed to prevent people in small cars being injured by people who hit them in big cars. We've also introduced new side impact crash tests. This is because 30% of all people killed or seriously injured in a side crash are on the non-struck side, so they're on the opposite side of the crash. And finally, AEB systems are getting better and better. So for active safety testing, we've introduced a new turn across path test which is for a vehicle that turns into a side road and maybe there's a pedestrian walking across, so it protects that. So these are the most exacting changes we've ever made. Only 10 cars were tested in the past year, but there are some outstandingly safe ones. Matthew, would you like to run us through the top three? The new Seat Leon gained the highest adult occupant protection score of 2020. That's great news because it's an affordable model that will be bought by many people. It performed well in the new deformable barrier test, protecting those inside it, as well as theoretically protecting the occupants of the opposing vehicle. Importantly, it comes as standard with front centre airbags that minimise injuries to the front seat occupants in the side-on crash. Its active safety systems work well too including its lane keeping assistance, which guides the car through corners whilst it's being driven using the adaptive cruise control. The Yaris is another new model that's very safe and affordable. As well as protecting its occupants well in a crash, it scores highly in our safety assist category. And that's significant because these tests scrutinize the active safety systems that help prevent accidents happening in the first place. As standard, the Yaris comes with an automatic emergency braking system that can detect and avoid vulnerable road users, and that can also prevent a collision with another car that's turning across its path. The Volkswagen ID3 has been designed with a very safe structure that protects its occupants and keeps the batteries secure in crash tests. The ID3 also gained the highest score yet in the side impact crash test thanks to the centre front airbags that prevent the two front seat passengers from knocking their heads together. As well as gaining the highest overall score of the cars tested in 2020, it was the top scorer for safety assist. Its standard automatic emergency braking system prevents accidents with cyclists and pedestrians and when the ID3 is approaching other cars and turning across the path of an oncoming vehicle. So which of these three takes the crown as the safest car of 2021? It has to be the ID3, because it's not only the highest score in many areas, it's the first of a whole range of pure electric vehicles being introduced by Volkswagen. And it's vital that car makers get the safety of these cars right before they're rolled out to a wider audience. Mm -hmm.